Butterflies There are butterflies almost everywhere in the world. Butterflies can be as tiny as this, or as big as this. All butterflies have two eyes, six legs, two feelers, and four wings. Butterflies hear with their wings and taste with their feet. They use their feelers to feel their way around. Butterflies can smell with their feelers too. Each morning, butterflies wake as the sun rises. They need to warm up before they can fly. So they stretch out their wings and sit in the sunlight. When they are warm, they flutter from flower to flower to feed. Butterflies can't chew food. They drink sweet juice from flowers called nectar. The nectar is hidden deep inside every flower. Butterflies hunt for nectar with their feelers. They can smell it from miles away. A butterfly's tongue is called a proboscis. It works like a straw. The butterfly pushes it deep down into a flower, and then it sucks up the nectar. The butterfly curls up its proboscis when it has finished feeding. Some butterflies live in dark jungles. Only a few flowers grow there, so they can't drink nectar. They suck juice from rotting fruit instead, or meat instead. There are butterflies that live high up on mountains. They have furry bodies to keep them warm. Others live in hot, dry deserts. They sleep in the shade and only come out after it rains. Lots of butterflies live in woods and forests. Some look just like leaves. This helps them hide from their enemies. A few butterflies have spots on their wings. The spots look like big, scary eyes. In spring or summer, all butterflies look for a partner. Female butterflies let off a lovely smell. Male butterflies flitter and flutter above the females. Then, the male and female butterflies get into pairs. Soon, after the female butterfly lays eggs, she lays one egg on each leaf. Inside the eggs are tiny creatures waiting to hatch. These creatures are called caterpillars. They look more like worms than butterflies. The caterpillar chews a hole in its egg. Slowly, it crawls out. The caterpillar is very, very hungry. First, it gobbles up the egg. Then it looks for other things to eat. It creeps and crawls along, wriggling its body. Up and down. The caterpillar eats and eats and eats. It grows bigger and bigger and bigger until it gets too big for its skin. The tight skin splits and the caterpillar wriggles out. There's new skin underneath. When the caterpillar is fully grown, it looks around for a safe spot to hide. The caterpillar curls up under a leaf. Slowly, its shape begins to change. The caterpillar loses its skin one last time. 
Underneath is a hard, shiny shell. This hard shell is called a pupa. The pupa hangs from the leaf. It doesn't move at all. Inside, something amazing is happening. The caterpillar is changing into a butterfly. Two weeks later, the butterfly is ready to come out. The pupa starts to crack. The butterfly peeps out, then it creeps out. The butterfly's wings are crushed and wet. It stretches them to dry in the sun. Carefully, the butterfly spreads its new wings. It swoops and sails through the sky. The butterfly flutters to a flower. Its wings shine in the sun. It sucks up nectar with its proboscis. Then it spies other butterflies flying above the flowers, and flutters up to join them.